Hey everyone, Dave Nelson here. In this video, it's number one in this series of how to edit your Lofty website. Now, a quick disclaimer, depending on if you're on a team or in a brokerage, um, you may not be able to do all of these editing because there's restrictions that they may impose on you. Now, I'm with Real. We have full capabilities. We have full ability to, to edit and personalize whatever we want to do. So whatever you're seeing here is going to be the maximum things you can do to your website. Again, if you don't see some of the stuff over the course of these series that you're able to do, make sure you talk to your team leader or your broker and figure out if you can if they'll let you do that or not. But um, that's why. So before we go forward, make sure you subscribe, like, and share this stuff because I'm taking time out of my day to do these videos to help you and mainly our industry get better because for sure we need it. All right, so in this video, I'm just gonna show you the basic. Where do you find how to edit your website? Very simple. So this is your main Lofty Chime, main Lofty CRM. You're gonna go right to the, the website and it's gonna open up a secondary window. So um, depending on if you're a team leader or a broker, you may see a bunch of sites on here. That's gonna be everybody that's in your account. Since I'm the only one in my account, it's pretty simple to do, it goes here. And this is the basic kind of the dashboard of what you want to do. And I'm going to go through these other things over here in other videos. But um, this is your this is your main, main basic uh, website. And this shows some traffic, some analytics. But then if you want to click here to editor, that's going to open up the actual website editor. So again, I'm not going to go through all this stuff in this video. I'm going to go more, more detailed in, in future videos. But that is how to find out how to edit your video, or excuse me, your website. And again, too, just remember, if you don't see these things, you're probably not allowed to do it by your either your brokerage or your team leader. And that's something you want to go and ask them. All right, that's it for this video. Make it super simple. But again, like, subscribe, and share. And uh, I'll see you in the next video.